So have you guys seen the, the pictures of this black hole? Uh, I'm sure you did, it was all over the internet yesterday. I mean, it's amazing, it really is amazing. And it annoys me so much that all of these idiots online yesterday were talking about how, how disappointing it is and how, how anticlimactic. Do you have any idea, when you look at that picture, do you have any idea what you're looking at? Uh, first of all, this is a thing that scientists theorized about based on mathematical calculations 100 years ago, and now here we have discovered it. Isn't, isn't that crazy that they could do that? that? That someone could just work out a math problem and say, well, so according to this, uh, there should be massive holes in space that suck in all the light and energy around them and crush it into non-existence. And then we look into a telescope and we say, oh yeah, well, there it is right there. I mean, and speaking of looking into a telescope, um, this thing is 55 million light years away. 55 million light years. Do you have any idea how far away that is? A light year is 5 trillion miles. So this is 55 million times 5 trillion. You know what that, you, do you know what that number is? I don't know what that number is. That's how, it, it, it's, it's, it's really, really, really big. Let's put it that way. So it, it is so far that you could travel at the speed of light, which is 670 million miles an hour, fast enough to travel around the entire globe seven times in one second. You could be going that fast and it would take you 55 million years at that speed to get there. If you started heading there at the dawn of human civilization, okay, you would still have right now, oh, another 55 million years to go. You, you, you basically wouldn't have even started your journey yet. You would, still be, you would still be so early in your trip that if you realized you left your wallet back on Earth, you might as well turn around and go get it um, because that's how vast the distances are that we're dealing with. And, 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 and I mean, if that doesn't blow your mind, then you must not have a mind that can be blown in the first place. I mean, come on, folks, come on. Uh, oh, and by the way, this black hole, okay, it's, it's, its mass is 7 billion times greater than the sun. You could plop our entire solar system and everything it contains inside it. The sun is just a speck of dust in comparison to this thing. The sun compared to this black hole is like you compared to the earth itself. But we're all disappointed because it's blurry. Oh, it's blurry. Yeah, the image, the image of the thing that's millions of quadrillion miles away is blurry. Oh, it's so blurry. Oh, I'm sorry about that. I'm sorry we couldn't get it in high def for you. I'm sorry that this image that took 55 million years to get to your eyeballs is is blurry. Oh, I you know, I'm I'm so sorry. Uh, yeah, yes, well that's that that's so disappointing. Meanwhile, a stupid trailer for the Lion King was released on the same day as this image of the black hole, and that Lion King tra trailer is literally just a slightly more realistic cartoon, which is a verbatim shot-for-shot -shot remake of another cartoon which only came out 25 years ago, yet that got a bigger reaction than the image of the black hole. People were astounded by that. They said, my God, look at this cartoon. You see that lion? He almost looks like a real lion. I mean, this cartoon, look at this cartoon. It's amazing, it's beautiful. That's what impressed everybody. Not the black hole, 55 million light years away. We are living in an idiocracy, folks. That's what we're living in. We, 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 are, we are surrounded, we are being, we are living in a black hole of stupidity and we're all being crushed to death by it.